What is up guys? Sage Fry here today and today we're doing another video. Um I just got this huge package from Amazon here, Fire. And uh we got three big packages and I feel like um I should start something. And what we're going to do is I got three new packages and we're going to do an unboxing video. So the three things we have here are of course Minecraft. The first is Steve and his horse Minecraft core figure. Looks really nice. Then we have the Animal Six Pack, along with our Spider Jockey. All right, so I think we're gonna start off with the smallest and go up. So I think we should start with Steve and his horse. Yeah, open up. Oh, there we go. Got a little knife here in case we need to open anything up. So here we go, in the flesh. So first, let's get Steve out. There we go. Just like a normal little Steve, nothing special. Move his arms, you can move his head, his legs. And now, I already have one of these Steves. We also have a little apple item with it. Very well textured. It's actually really well made products. And, uh, and I think the best made is our blocks, which in this set we have a hay block. Guys, you know horses and hay. They're all together, I guess. Um, there we go. We got a horse. Oh, you can move his tail around. You can take this saddle, and I believe you can take this off. Yes, you can. You can take off the saddle here. And now, we, I, can we? Nope. Sadly, oh, oh yes we can. Okay, I thought we couldn't take off the uh, top saddle, but we can. And uh, that's cool. We can also move the legs around, very flexible. And then we have the front legs, we can move those around as well. So front view, and a back view. And uh, that's actually really cool. Oh, you can move the front of the legs as well as the, you can move two joints. And then, so that's pretty much the uh, Steve and his horse. Wait, let's see here. Oh, Steve can partially kind of hold the apple. Not very well, but crap. Yeah, he doesn't hold it that well. But let's see something else here. Can kind of make the apple eat, make the horse eat the apple, but it'd be cool if they had like a little mouth gap here, which you could fit the apple in. So that's pretty much Steve and his horse. Oh wait, can he? Can he? He probably can. Steve can ride the horse as well. Look at that. Fits on, little saddle. He can move around, he can hold the apple probably while he's riding the horse. And there we go. That's Steve and his horse. So next up, we have something a bit bigger. We have the spider jockey. All right, let's open this baby up. Yes, this is where the knife comes in handy. There we go. Put that apart. Here we go. In the flesh. Oh yeah, I also noticed that you can uh, pop these little papers out here and use them for little logos, little Minecraft logos. So, uh, first we got our silverfish. This is really cool. I saw this and I was like, oh my god, I gotta get this. So, here they are from Amazon. Here we go, we got our little teeny silver fish. Top angle. Can move around and stuff. Boop. So we have three of these silver fish. Three of them. And then, we get the bow. Of course, if you're getting a skeleton, you need the bow with them. So here we go, we've got the bow. It has a little hinge on the side right there, so you can probably fit in the skeleton pants. And then we got the saddle part here, which I'll use that for later. And then we have our skeleton, yay. I'm pretty sure a lot of people have been waiting for this. Really well made, we even got the gaps in the back, gaps in the front, 
can move around his legs and all that. Oh, wow. Oh, his legs are on ball joints. Slight ball joints, you can move them inwards like that. But of course, if you move them around too much, they will kind of pop off. So you can move his head, flexible. Oh yeah, you can pop his head off, still intact. Put it back on, perfectly fine. That's pretty much the sum up of the skeleton. And now we have our spider. Looks really good. Ooh. I really like the spider. You can uh, you can't move the legs individually, but you can you can move them up and down, up and down like this. You can't move them individually, which is kind of sad. You can't move the head or anything, which kind of. Sucks too. They could come on, Mojang. You could put a little, a little ball joint in here. See, you can't move the head. Um, nothing really special about the rest of it. You can only move the legs a bit, but I still like it. It's a good addition to the series. Um, we also have our saddle on here. What do we do with this? Hmm. Oh, here we go. We slide it through the back of it. Here we go. Saddle on there. Okay. Now let's put the let's give the skeleton his bow. Of course. There we go. Skeleton bow. It'd be cool if they had some like arrows with this too, but you couldn't really launch them unless they took a lot of their time to make like a little launch mechanism on the bow. I don't know. I don't expect that much. The $20 toys, so. Oh, yes, if you didn't know, this is my birthday present. My birthday is in 15 days, people. I mean, 13 days. September 16th. Um, and I also have a little announcement for that at the end of the video, but let's stick to what we're doing. So, we got our skeleton on the jockey here. Doesn't fall off. Very sturdy. So, that's the sum up of the jockey. And now. The biggest one I'm happiest with. Here we go. This is the animal six pack. There. This looks so cool. cool. Alright. Nice. Um. Oh, what? Oh, that's cool. You can make like a little Minecraft setting here with this. You got the grass on the side and all that. That's pretty cool. You can use this for different stuff. But now, what we want, we all want to see, the animals. So what we got here, we got the chicken. Can move his head around. So, front like that, it's cool. And you can't move the legs, sadly. But you can move the wings and stuff. On little hinges right here. Flap, flap. Even though chickens can't fly, they will attempt to. Next we have the ocelot. You can move his head around. Uh, you can't move the legs, just like the chicken, but you can move the tail around. Which is really cool. They even have like a little bend and stuff. I'm not really happy with these toys. Mojang put out a really well-made toy series, which I'm happy about. So next we have the wolf, the first one that can actually move all four of its legs. Then we can move the head around all the way. And we have like a little red dog leash there. So that's the dog. Oh, oh, you can move the tail side to side as well. Just now noticed that. All right, next then we have the pig. Another movable head. All the way around. Then we have the little feet. You can slightly move them. And then we have these little back feet, which can go in like this, which I think can make it in a sitting position. I'm not really sure about those, but that's the pig. And then the other one, the sheep. It's another movable head. This is one of the biggest of the mobs. And then we got something special. Sheep can jump around on its feet. Use this as a little platform here. Sheep can jump around and stuff, which is really cool. Move the head around. I like these. But if you push it, even if you push it in far enough, it doesn't break or anything. 
And finally, we have the cow. Nothing too special about you, sir. Move the head. And then we can move the legs. Flexible legs. I like these. And, well, here we go. Let's give a little roundup of everything we've got in here, which is really awesome. Okay, we got Steve down here. Then we have Spider Jockey, Silverfish, I'm setting this up. And then we got our chicken, Oswald, So this is a little sum it up of what we have here.